feels good to be home though. Yeah. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and today's video is going to be about my hair that how do I style them, this is my signature hairstyle and you guys have literally harassed me with your requests that please 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 Mansi make a video on your hairstyle and how do you style them for your videos and in real life as well so yeah without further ado let's get started okay so in today's video we are just gonna talk about um, the post hair wash routine i'm not gonna talk about the hair care part that's gonna be another video which i'm gonna make very soon so don't worry about that now everybody has bombarded me with this question ever since i started my channel is that what is your haircut mansi so my haircut is v with layers it used to be v with layers but uh, recently last time i cut my hair i chopped them like till here uh, and um, it was bob with layers like long bob with layers uh, so i would suggest that any haircut if you put layers in it in a v shape you're gonna get the pretty much the same effect what i have in my hair so i cut my hair every four to five months um and i do not suffer from split end issue but if you are someone who suffers from that issue this is a great trick you have to cut your hair like trim your hair every four months it uh, helps to get rid of the split ends and then your hair grows healthier then the next question is about my hair color so if you uh, have been following this channel since a very long time you would know that i had jet black hair um and recently like i think before my birthday which was on 26th of jan i colored my hair um so i tried to vlog but i could not vlog on that day because um if you will you see the vlog i'll link the vlog on my screen somewhere so you can go and watch that vlog i could not vlog the actual process how um you know i colored my hair so i would like to tell you in this video how i colored my hair so i knew that i want maximum color over here like i knew that itna mujhe color chahiye pure baalon mein so here to you will distribute the color however you want but if you want uh, the proper transition you don't want to color just the ends and you know it will look like black and then brown or blonde you don't want to do that so what you have to do is once you take the section like this what you do is you color here like you make a v like this so as you can see there's a color here like there's a strand here and then like with a brush you can just like you know color the ends of uh, this triangle i would say and then in the end you will just distribute the color you will see um, you know how to color your hair in the video which i'll be linking down in the description so you will understand what exactly i'm speaking so l'oreal has only two variants uh, like the fashion highlights range has only two variants uh, one is this which is honey blonde and other variant is a brownie variant uh, so you can choose whichever you want um, so yeah i i just hope that you know they come up with more colors because i really like um, the effect that these highlights uh, this highlight color gives so you can give a try to those and also the quantity is very less so i used two uh, boxes of those to color my entire hair because i have a lot of volume in my hair touch wood um so i needed that much uh, color okay so now that the most asked questions are answered properly let's move on to the hair styling part so this is how my signature hairstyle is i always keep my hair like this either on this side or um at this side and a lot of people keep telling me that you should change your hairstyle but honestly i'm not going to change it because i love the way it looks like this so i wash my hair twice a week okay and i always make sure that i have oiled my hair overnight before washing them now when i wash my hair and i come out of the shower uh, obviously i will pat them dry with the normal towel and i like to take out the maximum amount of water uh, from my hair by uh, towel itself and then i like to go in with a hair dryer so i have been using this hair dryer it's by agaro and uh, it's the salon pro hd 5423 variant uh, now i have been using this since years i think more than 5 years i think and this hair dryer has three settings one is a zero that is a cold air setting then one which is a hot air setting and two is the highest uh, amount of heat you would get i will never use the hair dryer on the number two setting i always use it on zero and one so first i uh, dry my hair with the number one setting which is like a hot air setting and then in the end i like to finish up this drying process uh, by the zero number setting which is the cold air setting i use the hair dryer till my hair is like semi dry half dry and then i let my hair dry naturally
After my hair is totally dry, I like to go in with a heat protection spray because I am definitely gonna straighten my hair after this. Uh, so I like to use this spray. It's by Batiste and it's called the Shield My Locks Heat and Shine Spray. Now what I like to do is that I will section my hair as you can see in the demo. Like I section my hair like this and I'll take the um, partition and then I'll spray uh, this product and then I like to comb that section so that the spray or the product is evenly spread uh, in my locks. One more tip which I like to give you guys is that always wash your comb every time you wash your hair as well because um, and or do not share your comb with anybody so washing your comb will ensure that you are maintaining the hygiene after I have distributed the product um, like the heat protection spray all over my hair then I like to go in with uh, this straightener now this is by Vega and it was quite cheap I think I got this for 1800 if I'm not wrong I think I got this like a year or one and a half year back and it doesn't have any heat setting though it's like only one setting is there but you can choose whichever um, hair straightener you want and then straighten your hair however you like it so I always straighten my hair like this like perpendicular to my face I will never straighten my hair in a downward direction because if you uh, straighten your hair like this don't worry guys the straightener is not on a uh, thandai gura straightener yeah so if you straighten your hair like this in a downward direction what this will do is it will not give volume to your hair and by the end of the straightening session your hair will look very chumpu and not voluminous like how it's looking right now so always straighten your hair like this like perpendicular to your face what this will do is that will give volume to your uh, face volume to your hair while you straighten them after I have straightened almost all uh, parts of my hair then comes the crown area which is this area this one so uh, generally I keep my hair at this side you guys know that I always keep my hair at this side so what I like to do is when I come to the crown section I like to take all that crown section at this side and then I like to straighten it like this then I'll straighten this part then I'll take one more section I'll straighten it this side so you have to um, think what is your partition and then take the partition on the opposite side and then start straightening like this This will ensure that you again have volume in your roots. I hope uh, you guys are understanding what I'm trying to say. After the straightening process, you have to go with the serum to uh, like you know finish off the process. I like to go with the Levon serum. Now, do not use a lot of serum in your hair because um, it will look oily and not shiny. There's a thin line between shiny and oily. So if you use a lot of serum, your hair will look like weighed down and they will not look uh, voluminous. So yeah, keep that in mind. So I like to take a little bit of Levon serum and then I will run that uh, in the mid lens and the ends of uh, my hair. Okay guys, I guess that is it for today's video. I hope you liked it. If you did, then do not forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Also, let me know what other hair related videos you want me to do. Honestly, please do not tell me to make videos on hairstyles because I do not do any hairstyle to my hair. I'll either put them like this or I'll just like take my hair and put it in a pony or if not pony, then I'll just like make a bun and that's it. So, um... That, that's the only no, thing I know about hairstyles so yeah but uh, if you want me to make videos on hair care don't worry that video is gonna come up very soon so yeah I hope you like this and I'll see you in my next video also we have hit 70,000 on this channel let's get to 75 uh, very quickly and I shall see you in my next video until then stay positive and stay happy bye hair dryer that I have been using since years is there
different type of lashes today man 